You, you know, a stranger to the Valley, but this has been sort of home for a while, right? Yeah, yeah, I lived in Peoria, uh, started in 2011. Um, you know, it's only a four hour drive from my hometown, so it was real easy. Um, lived down here just so I can work out the facility um, and just get some extra work. So you know your way around now as a Diamondback, right? Um, uh, a little bit, yeah. A little bit. Yeah, it was a, it's a, a complete up opposite side, so. Have you been lost at all? No, I have my iPhone, so okay. <laughs> it's kind of hard all to right. get lost, yeah. Are you a uh, are you a breakfast guy, Taiwan? Sometimes. What do you do? Eggs, bacon, and toast. Solid, simple. Simple. Yeah. Make your own or go out. Usually make my own. Wife really? makes it for me sometimes. Yeah, my start day she makes me eat breakfast. Oh, she? Yeah, she does. So. Throw some carbs in your in. Yeah, she was. She forced me to get up and say, "Hey, I made breakfast for you." <laughs> so, <laughs> how about if you want to go out? Where would you go? We go to a place called uh, I think it's Butter Butters. Yeah. Yeah, it's right, it's right down the street, so. Where will you go there? What would you dive in on the menu there? Uh, I always get the omelet with uh, potatoes in it and sausage nice. every time, yeah. How about uh, dinner? If you guys were going to have a date night or a night out on an off night? Steak 44. Yeah, it's the best place. Take me on the menu. What would you get? Um, the biggest steak to have, mac and cheese and mashed potatoes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Sometimes no. it's Caesar salad. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> All right, let's talk social media. You, you might be the most prolific tweeter on Twitter of the Diamondbacks, right? Why, why do you like it so much? I feel like there's a lot of funny stuff on there, you yeah. know? I just, I haven't been tweeting a lot lately. I used to be really into it, but now I just kind of like scroll through and mm -hmm. see what's going on in the world, see what's going on in the sports world. Your shoes are on Twitter a lot. They are. You're a shoe guy. I love shoes. How in the world did that start? Just kind of started buying some shoes and, <laughs> you know, a couple buddies of mine, a couple teammates, you know, they were into shoes too. And so I feel like every single day, uh, when I was living in Arizona, we just walk across the street to the mall and buy a new, new pair of shoes. How many pair do you think you have? Uh, probably close to 200. Are there any that you haven't worn that you have? There's, there's a few, yeah. There's a few. Yeah. Are there shoes that you don't have yet but will get? Probably. Is there a holy grail of a pair of shoes that you have? Um, I have some Yeezys. Yeah, Nike Yeezys. <laughs> yeah. But they're a gift from Felix Hernandez. They're pretty cool. That is pretty yeah. cool. Yeah. Good for you. Pokemon Go, did you go? Uh, I'm a big Pokemon fan. Okay. But I couldn't get into Pokemon Go. Thank you. Yeah, it was it was too tough, and plus I didn't really feel like walking around trying to catch Pokemon. But why Pokemon? Why do you like Pokemon? Uh, that was my first game I got when I was a kid. I moved from Louisiana to Redlands, California with mm -hmm. my mom, and my dad had got it for me. Uh, it was my first game. I got a Game Boy and Pokemon, and so I remember I remember playing it. What was it like to have a bobblehead in your name in honor, essentially? Yeah, it was cool. That's, I mean, it lives forever, right? Yeah, it definitely does. You know, I have, uh, this is my fourth one. I had two minor league ones and two in the big leagues, and it's, it's definitely really, really awesome. And you have two dogs. And I have two dogs, yes. Do they run the show? Uh, they do. Yeah, of course they do, right? Yeah. What are their names? What kind of dogs? Kiki and Nala, both French bulldogs. Do they get along? At first they didn't, so... Nala was the first one I got. She's with my sister. They got attached, so I kind of okay. let my sister have her. And then so I got Kiki two years ago. And she is, uh, she's a little crazy, yeah. <laughs> hyper. She always, always wants to play. Um, but when they first met, they didn't really like each other. They're both females, so they didn't like each other too much. But now all they want to do is play, so it's good. You have a favorite tattoo? Um, yeah, this one right here. Why? What is uh, it? So my brother drew it. Um, my grandma passed away, and it says grandma, yep. and he has the exact same one and the same spot on his arm, so. That's really special. Yeah. That lives forever, too. Yeah. You're like a big kid with a super intelligent yeah. mind, and you're an athlete at the highest level. Do you realize all the things you got going on? Yeah, I do. That's do awesome. you enjoy this? I do, very much, yeah. Does it, is, I mean, are you enjoying the opportunities that this allows, though, for you to have along the way yeah. because you, not everybody has this but you have a lot yeah i mean i i definitely enjoy it. even you know the first day i got drafted and you know you hear stories about the long bus rides in the minor leagues and you know the bad hotels and i really i enjoyed every single bit of it all the 12 hour bus rides and you know i just because i never really you know explored, got out of my home city and mm -hmm. so you know i was just stuck there and so i got drafted i was had the opportunity to, to travel a lot and see different places on the other yeah. side of the country i never got to see last question then so what is home what's your hometown ukaipa california and where's yeah. that san Bernardino area okay. yeah so, so i'd Cal go through it on my way to big bear 
Yeah, you do. Okay, yeah. so if so going to LA, you will pass it going to LA. Okay, so if you could take one thing from there, if it's a restaurant, food, something yeah. that you can't get here, what would you bring from there to here? Bakers. What is it? Uh, it's like a like a fast food Tex-Mex burger type okay. thing, but they have really good chili cheese fries. So chili cheese fries. Yeah, every time I go back home, I always make sure I get it at least once or twice. I love it. Yeah. Thanks, Taiwan. Yeah, thank I want you. Want you to work.